Hello everyone, David Lee here. Last year I created a video about a second grade PBL unit where students took on the role of city planners. You can find the link to the video in the description below. This year they actually created a city plan for the local community near our school. We visited the local community to empathize with the needs and wants of the community members. At the end of the unit, we had our first annual city planning expo where the city's actual urban planner came to visit to see what the students designed and came up with. Here's some footage of the expo. Enjoy. What are some new additions to the local community? Um, what would you add? You would add a market. A market? Okay. Well, Why a market? The market is right here because we thought that our, our markets don't have much variety and unhealthy items. Mm -hmm. There's not much items and, and we thought that we thought that we would make a market, a big market, and it would have a lot of variety, healthy food. We'll add a playground. a playground. A playground. Can you locate the playground for me in the map? Here. Here. Does the city have to have an area that where you play and kind of rest? Yeah. Okay. Or else people like in the community will be happy. What's going to be there? A hospital. Oh, a hospital. Hi. So basically, so basically, we walked through our community and we tried to find a place where you can put our hospital. We walked around for ages trying to find it. So what did you add to the local library. community? Because library. So you can have jobs where there are already a lot of jobs here. But also the two reasons, because where are you going to get better at reading? Where are you going to get better at reading? No. Better at learning? Absolutely. And those are all things in the library. When the school when school's over, you have another place to learn, right? Yeah. yeah. Cool. What would you add to your community? Kids uh, cafe because there's like no uh, like play and we need it at but, least one in our community. But now, why is it important for the city to have a place to play? They okay. can rest there. They can rest. So is does resting and playing does that make the people happy? Yeah. Yeah. Thank you. These are our why we should build. This is to the city planner why you should build a restaurant, restaurant in the co community. Mm -hmm. And there's also lots of reasons, and you explain about them. There's three um, reasons. So like this is the letter to the um, and if you want city to planner. This is our video that we made. Seem to have created a place, a dance studio. Awesome. A dance. Empty. It's an empty lot. Is that why you put it there? Yeah. Cool. Also, mom can go shopping, and so you can see a commercial. For a model for me right here, this landform model. This. Yeah. Um. This is our plane, mm -hmm. and like right here is KIS. Okay. Here's the valley, but we didn't label it because it doesn't look like a valley because like we covered it. Okay. And then here's the mountain. Okay. And, and where's KIS? KIS is right here. Is the valley. And so it's located on the hill. Yeah. Huh? And there's the river right here. Mhm. Mm because KIS is on the side of the hill, it looks like there will be a lot of erosion. What are some solutions you have for erosion? And this one, it sticks onto the ground. Is so that it a building? Yeah, this is a building. Mm -hmm. It just like sticks onto the ground so it doesn't move anywhere. Even when there's erosion? Yeah. Who can tell me about this vegetation? Make, make it erosion stop. This wall is because if erosion comes, it can be stopped by this wall. Okay. And then, and then this one's for like... So basically what the water games 
it could like just slide a little. Okay. So basically what he built is a retaining wall. Right. Got it. Next year, we hope to invite more of the local community to the expo. Thanks for watching. Feel free to click on the like button if you enjoyed the video and click on the video on the right to watch an overview of what the unit was all about. And click on the left to subscribe to the channel for more content like this. I'd like to give a special thanks to the following people for making this project possible.